Tonight we have extraordinary video of two senior citizens busted keying cars at a popular southeast shopping centre. They targeted luxury vehicles, not realising cameras were rolling the whole time. On a sunny afternoon at Brookside Shopping Centre, a senior citizen is up to no good. He keys a BMW first, then checks to see if anyone's watching. His next target, a Tesla. Police say this man is 70-year-old Raymond Edwards, who is there with a woman. She joins in too. In a Gucci T-shirt, she uses her hand to try and cover the key, but the unlikely vandal is caught by the car's cameras. They're just fruit loops. What do you think motivates, like, older people to do something like that? Jealousy. Well, very disappointed, very uh, unhappy that it happened. It looks like it was targeted at certain vehicles. A search on social media reveals Raymond loves fast and fancy vehicles. A racing car enthusiast pictured at major events in Newcastle and Bathurst, even rubbing shoulders with New Zealand racing star Fabian Coulthard. What's the point? What makes you want to key people's car? Brittany Ellis says her Hyundai was keyed on the same day at Brookside Shops too, but there is no evidence the attacks are connected. I was in the shops with my client, which she um, has a disability sticker and I came out and my car was completely keyed. Seeing my car being keyed it was devastating because I'm like my baby. The Tesla owners who don't want to be identified are devastated too, telling Seven News they've been quoted almost $2,000 to fix the scratches. Raymond Edwards has been charged with two counts of willful damage and is due to face Brisbane Magistrates Court on December 11. The woman is yet to be charged, but if the pair is found responsible, they'll be banned from Brookside Shopping Centre. There's potential for ban, so if people do come back and who were banned, and obviously uh, they're considered being trespassers, and police gets notified. Yeah. Proof if you think no one's watching, you're probably wrong. Rachel Baxter, 7 News.